<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we're back with some more Skyblock! Oh, look at my beautiful world! Hmm, it's looking so good. Before we get started, I've got a question for you. Do you know what in this chest is? You have three seconds to guess. Two, one! It's the like button! <laughs> Yay! See, you guessed it right. I know you did. Wait, you didn't? Well, now you have to click the like button. Let's go for 100,000 likes. If we hit that, I'll upload episode three. All right, so now that you've liked the video, make sure you subscribe and go to jellystore.com because there is a crazy 50% off summer sale. That's right, up to 50% off on jellystore.com. Link in the description. Did my tree just grow? Yes! Hello tree, welcome to my world. For today's Minecraft Skyblock episode, we're actually doing something quite spectacular. I've never done this before, but you've seen the thumbnail, you've seen the title. We're gonna make a mob grinder. That's right, we are going to kill zombies, creepers, uh, skeletons, everything that spawns with the name mob. Wait. They don't spawn with the name mob. Doesn't matter. Now, like I said, I have never created a mob grinder spawner thing before. So, um, we're up for a little challenge today. Now, I've done the research, okay? I watched basically every single mob grinder build tutorial <laughs> on YouTube. So, I feel like I'm a professional now, and I know exactly what to do. All right, so I think, all right, I think we have to start with creating a portal to go to the nether. Yup, that's what we gotta start with. Why, you might ask? Well, in the nether, we've got another sky block. And there should be a chest with something epic inside. So, let's have a look. We have 10 obsidian that we found on the sand block island right over there. So, we're gonna have to use this obsidian to create a nether portal. I was thinking, I'll make that one right over there. But, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a little bit of a problem. This right here is sand. And sand, like you guys know, falls down if you break a single block. We're gonna have to fix that. But, you know, I wanna capture the sand, of course, but I can't really get down there. So, we gotta use my bucket to grab the water and build down? If that makes sense? I don't know, I read this in the comments. Thanks for all the tips, by the way. You guys were really, really helpful. I think one of you guys said to use water to build down. All right, so we're gonna grab our water and we're gonna, wait, these guys need dirt blocks right next to them, don't they? Okay, here we go, now they can grow. Thanks, comments. Back to where we were gonna do something. We've got the water bucket. We're gonna put this down, let's say right over, right over here. Okay, yeah, that's, that's pretty good, I think. All right, I need to be really careful here because I'm gonna go down, boys. Ah! Don't like this. I don't like this. What am I doing with my life? All right, so... No! No! No, it fell down! Are you kidding me? I'm so dumb. I shouldn't have built right next to it. Oh. I just ruined the sand. I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? Comments? W what can I do with sand anyway? You can make glass, but who needs glass? I'm so dumb. I just got rid of all the sand. And that was exactly the thing I didn't want to do. Ah, I feel so stupid. And now I've got this obsidian block here that I can't get rid of. I'm so dumb too. What did I do that? This is my first sky block world, okay? Please excuse me. One, two, we need three, right? Yeah. All right, a block of cobblestone and then two in the middle. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. What's up, Portal? How you doing? Looking good today, my friend. All right, we're gonna we're gonna get a pickaxe. We're gonna mine this away. We're gonna make like a little stair staircase entrance, and we need to turn this on. That's another question I had. I thought I needed like a flint and steel, but you can just use lava. So we're gonna use lava to set some wood on fire to turn the Nether portal on. Oh no, it's getting dark. We need to go to the Nether really quickly, guys. All right, now I don't want to sprint because when sprinting, you actually uh, get hungry faster and hunger kills you. So yeah, luckily I have been placing slabs down and that's another question I had that you guys answered for me. Mobs do not spawn on slabs. So that is really, really useful. But these phantom things do appear, which are in the sky. All right, so that's our entrance, I guess. We can make it more pretty later. Let's put some wood down right over here. Don't really know how to do this perfectly. And we gotta make sure we don't waste the lava. All right, I only have one. All right, now I'll put that one on top. And now we wait. I think it should set fire anytime soon. Okay, <laughs> I'm so scared. How about in the meantime, we just expand our little platform with slabs. I got plenty of these anyway. I literally have a cobblestone form. Ah, we've got fire! Yes! Okay, it's working, it's working. That took a while, by the way. 
Yes! Oh! Okay, pick up the lava. Oh, it worked! The nether portal! Oh, it's working! I'm the happiest boy alive. All right, I'll take this wood back. Don't burn it, please. All right, fire is gone. Woo, that was pretty cool. See, I am good at this game, okay? <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna put these things back before there are tons of mobs in the nether and then I die. Oh, also, I probably should say I was mining cobblestone, a lot of it, before I recorded. So I have a lot of cobblestone to build this mob grinder. Don't you worry. Oh, look at my beautiful portal. Let's go to the nether. All right. Oh, goodness. What's gonna happen? Ah. <gasps> We're here. I thought I would spawn on that block. But apparently I don't. I need to build my way through. Okay, I gotta get cobblestone. <laughs> I can jump down and just build my way up again. Yay! Hello, guys! Mushrooms and chest and new nether portal. I didn't know there was gonna be another one here. We could try and turn that one on. Here we go. We got some brown mushrooms and red mushrooms. What's in the chest? Oh, we got another ice block. Sugar cane, which we really needed the sand for. Oh, that's awkward. And a birch sapling. Okay, that's just some other type of tree. I'm not sure what we can do with that. Let's build our way up. Let's bring this home. I'm not sure what we can do in the in the nether right now. Maybe we can try and turn on that other portal, but where is that going to bring us? <gasps> Wait, that's obviously going to bring us to another island. Um, Yeah, we should probably turn that on, but... We're, today's focus is the mob grinder, so we're gonna build that first. And the sun's up again. Whew, okay, that's good. Hopefully, we can find some more sand later on. Otherwise, the sugar cane is completely useless. That's right. We need to create an infinite source of water. It's quite easy to make. All we gotta do is uh, find a place for it. Maybe right over here, just on the corner of the map. All right, and then we need to build something at the bottom. Now, I actually worked my way down here a little bit. All right, here we are. We're gonna put these guys down. There you go. Now, it's closed off, and if I'm correct, we should be able to create an infinite source of water. Ah, yes, it works. Oh, I'm a happy boy. Okay. <laughs> All right, so one goes in this corner, and this one will go in this corner. Yes! We've got infinite water! Oh my, I am so happy now. Now that we have infinite water, all we have to do is create the mob grinder. That's right. We're gonna need a lot of stuff, mainly cobblestone for now. So let's use the cobble slabs to build a platform towards it. We've got the nether portal right there. How about I make it this way? So I really don't know how far away I need to build it for my, for my thing. Wait, no, I'm, I'm not gonna build it here. This is gonna be a shadow. Cause it's gonna be tall. I don't wanna be in the shade. I hope that makes sense. We're gonna build it here instead. All right, so let's build up. So I think we gotta build up 23 blocks. Oh, so we're almost there. Wait, how am I gonna get down? I should probably bring a bucket of water so I can go down as well. Okay, I should have thought about this. This is not good. All right, we're back at it. 23 blocks up. This is one, two, uh, three. There you go. Woo! Oh, okay, that's really high up. So now we build a square. And we've got the square, and we gotta build, I think in each direction, eight Block, so that's two, five. Oh god, I'm nervous. Oh no, I just ruined it. Six, seven, and eight. Okay, let me count that to make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's good. Okay, there we go. We've got eight blocks in each direction. So now, I think I need to create a wall. I think we're almost there. Woohoo! And now, I think we have enough blocks to build a floor. That's right. Okay, so I gotta be really careful, actually, because because mobs could start spawning here. All right, starting to look pretty good. We got two floors complete, but we actually have to build a ceiling as well, because otherwise they don't fall in the water. I should probably head down. Mobs are probably gonna spawn. Okay, let's go down. All right, I can go, start, go down here, and then I can build up later. Whew! Okay, we don't need the water. I should have thought about that. Great, now I'm gonna- I'm gonna be really careful because mobs can spawn there right now. As you guys can see, it is dark. You gotta be kidding me. No! 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 Come on! Stupid creeper. You killed the traitor! I could have used him. At least we know that it's somehow working. What? So, I'm gonna- I'm gonna cobblestone farm and make sure that I don't die. I guess. And I'm just gonna wait out the night. Okay, I'm gonna grab a fork and I'm gonna put that on my mouse. 
Look! No hands mining! Yes! Alright, now I'm just gonna have to wait because we need a lot of cobblestone. <laughs> All right, would you look at that, ladies and gentlemen? I've got 170-something cobblestone pieces. I think that'll be enough to finish the farm. How about we get out of here? <laughs> if you look at my health, by the way, I am slowly dying, so that's not good. Oh, we burnt the tree down, apparently. Great. Something we can use for food is apples that fall from trees if we break them, but here's the thing. I think if I finish the grinder, I can just eat rotten flesh. All right, let's just go up and finish this thing because it's, it's kind of taking forever. I'm gonna be honest here. Wait, what? Why is there a bone here? We've got our first bone, which we can use for bone meal to grow plants and stuff quicker. That's awesome. I gotta look up what else I can do with bones, but I don't think I can do anything else with it. But cool, I guess a skeleton died here. That means the spawner is working. All right, I think we might not have enough cobblestone again. <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Do I need to create a ceiling? That's what I'm wondering. I think I at least need to create walls on the side, but ceilings, maybe not. I've got a lot of slabs. Like, what if I do this? Can you jump on that? No, you can't. That'll do, I think. Another good thing about this wall is that no mobs can spawn on them, but we just ran out of slabs. So yeah, we got to dig our way down again. I should probably bring some water up now because we can start turning this grinder on. And once it's turned on, all we gotta do is wait for nighttime. Wait. Uh oh, don't look in its eyes. Don't look. Don't push me. An Enderman. Ah! <laughs> also, I know why this is not growing now. First of all, you needed a block for the thing to spawn on, and you need water that doesn't run. There you go. I think that works. This is very cramped. I need to fix this. First, we do the mob grinder though, but just waiting for the uh, for the furnace to finish up. All right, buddy. There's your water. Wow, looks so good. Oh my god, it's getting nighttime. We need to go up right now. Okay, is this a good idea or a bad idea that I'm gonna rush this? I need more slaps. Forgot about the slaps. Ah, no, the mobs are gonna spawn. All right, I don't think they spawn now because I put the torches down. So, we need water. First one will go right there. Does it work? Okay, we need two each, of course. Um, eventually, guys, maybe I should, you know, mine some more cobblestone. We could actually create a second floor on this so more mobs will spawn. That would be pretty sick. Okay, that is our slab wall. Next, we just gotta get all the water. That's all we gotta do. Here we go. We're just gonna create an infinite source of water up here so I don't have to run up and down the whole town. <laughs> I'm smart. Hey, we got a pumpkin! Oh, I'm so happy now. Now it works. So I get rid of this and then I put a new one down, right? So we can get four more pumpkin seeds. I think this is the last time I'm gonna have to build up, guys. I'm excited for this to work. Do you think I'm gonna be able to do it? Oh, I think I am. I mean, mobs are literally already spawning there, so what's the worst that could happen at this point? All right, infinite source. There we go. Okay, I just it just looked like it didn't work for a second, but it's working. So now I gotta be really careful because I obviously don't want to fall down. So look, this is what the water does. The zombies and whatever will spawn on the floor and they will start falling down the water slide eventually, falling into this hole right here, which is not here yet. And then they die. Maybe we can even test it tonight. I don't know how long the, the night time's gonna last. We really need food though. We really need food. Yes? Yes! It works! I am a legend, boys! So next, I gotta think of something. Let's let's open this hole up. Wait, it keeps flowing. Is it because of that? Yeah, it's because of that. Hmm. That's gonna be scary. I don't wanna die here. Uh I'm 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 stupid. <laughs> That's what it comes down to. Okay, there we go! Ah, I did it! I almost fell off! Okay. But I was holding shift. So that was it. Oh, I think we I think we did it. I, I think. All right. <laughs> but the sun is actually coming up. So we literally have to wait a full day for it to see in action. I guess what we got to do now is um, extend the landing area, which is, of course, right over here. Really don't know how much I need to extend it by. But I just want to make sure they don't fall off. I'm not sure if they fall down in a straight line. Maybe they're like moving around a little bit. I don't know. This is my first farm, okay? My first mob grinder. All right, so just adding a little wall to make sure that we cannot fall off. Look at that. I actually think that looks really good. We cannot put torches on them, but we can put torches under like that. Perfect. Boys, we've got ourselves a grinder. Woo! And now we wait. <laughs> Did our melon grow yet? 
don't think it's gonna grow. Let's get rid of it and put a new one down. Okay, I, I don't know what's wrong with these melons, man. Let's uh, let's actually fix this fix this up a little bit because we've got a huge grinder now. We need to step up our game. We're cool now. We're we're a legit sky blocker now. Also, you know how I built this staircase down over here, right? This actually gives us the option to take all of this dirt, which we're really gonna need for growing trees, growing melons, pumpkins, and sugar canes. We're gonna need dirt, a lot of it. So uh, let's actually get some stuff so I can build. Wait, we actually have 15 dirt still. I didn't even know that, but we need the rest too. We're gonna replace it with cobblestone. Do I have cobblestone? Ah. I'm smelting it for normal stone because I want to make a nice house eventually. Oh no, do I really have to use you again? I guess we have enough dirt for now. <laughs> but eventually, because I built the way down, we can uh, we can steal all the dirt back. So that's that's a good plus. That's a good upgrade. Oh yeah, it's getting nighttime. Yes, I'm uh, auto mining again. It's it's a hack with a fork. <laughs> All right, let's pick up all these remaining cobblestone pieces. I've just been using this because eventually on my mob spawner, I do want to create a ceiling because then it's always dark in there. When it's always dark in there, they will continue spawning. That's right. Look, we have more saplings now. Ooh, we got some we got some remaining pieces. We're actually doing really well, apart from the fact that I lost all the sand. How about we have a look if this thing works? All we gotta do is stand at the bottom and hope I build it high enough because then o otherwise they will land here and attack. Wait, I should probably put all my stuff back just in case that happens. You know, why is there a creeper there? I'm so confused. Did I not build it high enough? Clearly something. Ah, wait, you attack me. Somebody could have told me that. I did not know this was gonna happen, guys. I'm straight up going to die. Okay, at least we pushed that guy off. Oh no, like it's working. A lot of mobs are falling down, I think. I haven't actually seen it happening yet, but they're not dying, which means I need to build it one block high, one block lower, one block. It's seriously one block of a difference. Oh, see, they're falling down. I wish I could easily close that thing because all the mobs are spawning now and I have half a heart. Wait, ah, no, 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 you're not killing me little. Oh no, my tree! My bloody tree! It's the stupid lava! I'm just gonna clap and then it's fixed, okay? It's working! It's working! <laughs> Look at all this stuff! Oh, I am the happiest boy alive right now. I literally spent about one and a half hour creating a mob grinder. I finally get to use it, but now it's raining. And I bloody hate rain. But look at that. Look at the skeleton. Oh, rest in peace. Thanks for the arrows. Oh, <laughs> thanks for the rotten flesh. So we got creepers and spiders coming down as well. Oh, woo. So we can actually create a bow and arrow and use the arrows. That's crazy. Hello, zombie. Oh my goodness. There's literally so many of them. This is only the start. I love it. Gunpowder. Oh, finally, we've got a mob spawn. I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. Obviously, guys, this is not giving me any XP, but I don't think I need XP because I can't enchant anything anyway. Ah, that was on top of me. Whoa, wait, what? Wait, I have never heard of that. What is that? What? Wait, <laughs> a golden armor zombie? Oh my god. That's ridiculous. That's where I'm leaving this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. In the next one, we're gonna explore some more sky blocks through the nether portal. Leave a like if you wanna see episode three. Bye. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, click on that subscribe button and also make sure to check out the new exclusive Jelly Army t-shirts on jellystore.com.